Okay, I got this thing completely uh, painted up with the uh, latex paint. Now we're going to start up with another layer. Uh, this, I'm going to a, uh, I think it's called neutral gray. It's a uh, acrylic base paint. We we'll use it a little more sparingly than we did the other. And just using the same brush. This I'm using a a one inch like house painting brush. Grab the black base coat. Go with your lighter and lighter grays. Bring it up. Until it gets lighter and lighter and lighter and lighter and lighter. You know, doing less coverage every step. So, like when you do dry brush, let's say you go with a um, your darkest coat will be over the black will be about 80% coverage. Then you go down to 60, 40, 20 as far as the overall surface. And just keep doing that and doing that day gray and then from this gray I'll start adding white to it to get brighter and brighter so let's load your brush This we're doing some real highlight things here. When you start getting into the really light colors like this, I find it anyway, what you want to hit is the very tops, like the very tops of these rocks here, to really make those stand out. And then you want to hit your edges, like along here the top of this edge. You just want to hit the edges, and that really makes the edges pop on the piece. You know, and just going around hitting these very edges.
you see when you get these things like this? See, I hit this, it's really light there. I don't like that. What I can do, go, I'll go back in with a darker paint and blend it later on because what I'm going to do with that anyway is something I'll show you here in a little bit when I get to... I'll go back in with black and what we're going to do is do a look like it's charred around there and put in some black around the edges to make it uh, look singed like it either had a bomb blast go off or... Uh, <clears throat> or um, this is what I'm talking about, just a quick brush across the lighter colors. We'll bring up some uh, just some textures. What we're going to do stuff. here is I'm going to put, I think, one last layer on this. And this layer is going to be almost completely white. Putting a little bit of gray to darken it up. And then we're going to put some, then we're going to put a lot of white in this. And like I said, this layer is going to be almost white. And I'm just going to hit just choice areas. And then, uh, see, it's going to be almost white, almost. And then uh, what I'll do is go back in with the black and uh, really uh, like do some char work and stuff on that. And the top of these rocks, hit the back of that one, hit these here to really make those pop. And then hit my edges here and there, just a quick brush across here and there, one down through here to really make these I'll use some of this pop. pure black. Now I'll tell you what guys, if you're looking for a pure black paint, if I can find the bottle here. Okay. This stuff is and it when it says pure black, it's not lying. This stuff is grand. And it comes out thick too. Dries pretty quick. It's good stuff. So This is pure black, so. And I just stipple this, kind of stipple this onto the project right around these holes, and it gives the idea of like a blast. And I do that here and there it's around here down spots. here, around the edges of the wall, because I want to make it look like something blew up this wall. And I try not to hit too much around the edges because I do not want to get rid of my dry brush too much. So, uh, but I do want to make it kind of look like carbon scoring almost, like, and and that kind of thing. Like, there's a, you know, been a fire or there's been some fire involved, an explosion, um, whether it be, um, and I won't do so much of that on the inside. Because I want the, because I want this to look like it blew from the outside in. So, and that's it, guys. Um, I hope that uh, my painting tutorial was as clear as possible. I know I didn't. Uh, this paint job's a little rushed. It's not quite as good. I don't think as the other one. But um, that's basically it. I hope that helped you guys out. And uh, if you guys do uh, make your own. Uh, Concrete walls, man. Make sure if I'm not subscribed to you, give me a yell and let me know, and uh, I'll try to check it out. I want to see all the stuff that you guys can make. So we're going to call this one done, and uh, I will talk to you guys later.